pain. He's here. And Sasuke? He looked well. He had ample control over the power of the Sharingan. The time is ripe. The Hidden Leaf Village should also start to act soon. What about the Nine Tails? Take him down with Conan. Do not fail. Understood. Be on your guard just in case. Naruto Uzumaki. He is no longer just a boy. And now he has rather considerable jutsu, as well as many comrades. It won't be easy. It's useless telling us to fear our target. Pain has never lost. <laughs> well, that's true. Chapter 6. The Tale of Jiraiya the Gallant. Hey, Tsunade. Oh, Jiraiya. This is unusual. You never visit out of the blue like this. Well, I've got my hands on some unusual information. Unusual information? Brace yourself. We've located the leader of the Akatsuki. You... you what? Is that true? Details. Tell me everything. And that's the sum of it. I see. The Hidden Rain Village, huh? Right. The head of the Akatsuki is somewhat revered there. They call him Pain. That's a very reclusive village. Investigating this won't be easy. Yeah, that's why I've got to go in alone first to investigate. Uh, alone? No, it's too dangerous. Hey, relax, will you? But... I'm the only shinobi in this village who can get in and out of there in one piece, with the info we need. <sighs> Jiraiya, just come back alive. If I lost you too, I... <laughs> what? Are you gonna cry? Aw, oh, that makes my day. Hush, you fool. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I won't die so easily. Relax. I... I know. All right, I'll be off then. Nothing spoils as fast as fresh intel. Jiraiya. See you, Sonari. So, I'm headed for the Hidden Rain Village. I guess that means I go to Tenshi Bridge first.
pretty sure I've come around here with Naruto before. Maybe I'll take a little side trip. <laughs> this takes me back. The training was long, but the end is in sight now. You did well to make it through without giving up. Huh. The words give up don't exist in my world. <laughs> in that case, let me test you to see whether you really don't give up or not. Huh? Is that today's training? Yes, it isn't anything complicated. It's a practical training to test your progress so far. An all-out battle. You versus me. Show me everything you got. What I've got, huh? This time, though, I'll be fighting for real, too. Expect to be knocked down easily unless you use all your power. Ha! You too, Pervy Sage. Don't get scared when you see what I've really got. That a boy. All right, then. Let's go. Here I come. Now, then, let's see how he's doing. He's got some weak points, but he's definitely grown stronger. <sighs> and... Not yet. 
I'm not done yet. This mental stamina and guts that won't quit. Burby Sage, come on, one more match. No, that's enough. I got a good idea of your strength. I can still fight. I don't want to quit when I'm down. Burby Sage. <laughs> <laughs> What? What are you laughing for? Well, it looks like that got passed on as well. Huh? What are you talking about? No, nothing. Just talking to myself. What? His eyes just then. And that hardcore grit. I swear, he's just like his father. <laughs> All right, we should get moving again. Not much further to Tenchi Bridge, finally. Now then, it all begins here. Let's... What is it, Pain? Someone is obstructing my reign. The feel of this chakra. He's an expert. What should we do? You shouldn't even need to ask. All who hinder me shall be wiped out. There is nothing else. Then? Right. I'll go make the preparations. I leave the rest up to you, Conan. Of course. Right. Infiltration complete. The Hidden Rain Village. Hmm. I can't help but remember those kids. That was back during the Second Great Ninja War, when there was still no end in sight. Tsunade and I and Orochimaru, we fought against the Hidden Rain Village, and that's where I met them. Those three. Yahiko. Konan. Nagato. They'd all been orphaned by the war. I felt sorry for them, so I decided to look after them until they could stand on their own two feet. We lived under the same roof, shared a brief peace together. Even in the hidden rain, where the shadow of war still fell, those kids grew strong and sturdy, little by little. Uh, looking back on those days now, I realize just how much they meant to me. A few years later, they'd made names for themselves in several battles, but then I heard rumors that they died. Well, that's how the world works. There's no avoiding it, but still, it breaks your heart. Uh-oh. Mustn't do that. This is no time to get lost in memories. I've got a job to do. If I go back empty-handed, 
Tsunade will never let me live it down. Nor those three. All right. Guess I'll start. When did the rain stop? The end of the rain marks the beginning of our fight. That voice... It's time for God's punishment to descend on the unworthy. <laughs> this takes me back. I was just thinking about you. However, I never thought we'd be reunited under these circumstances. Conan. You've really blossomed since I last saw you. What does a villager of the Leaf want here? I'm investigating the leader of the Akatsuki. Imagine my surprise running into you. Does that mean that Pain is either Yahiko or Nagato? Knowing that would be meaningless. Your life is just going to end here. Well, well, listen to you. We are no longer on your side. Our wishes and ideas aren't what they were before, Jiraiya-sensei. Hmm. <laughs> Jiraiya-sensei, huh? Why? Why did you stoop to working for the Akatsuki? Even amongst the three of you, you were particularly kind-hearted. Why are you... You don't know what we were like after that. What happened, what we thought, why we survived. Conan. In the end, you can't possibly understand us. You're just a remnant of our past. If you oppose the Akatsuki, it doesn't matter who you are. I will destroy you. Even if our time together was short back then, without a doubt, I was the master, and you three were my students. If those students are guilty of something, as a master, I must settle it. Pointless. <laughs> maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Can't know until I try. Now, witness the white-haired boy's dervish dance! Let my earth-shattering super ninjutsu burn into your retinas! Oh! <laughs> 
You lose, Kona. Don't put up a pointless fight. You lose, Conan. You are skilled, as always. But I was only buying time. What? Your opponent is him. <gasps> so, I finally meet him then. He's here, just up ahead. It will probably be a fierce fight, but I can't just stay here. All right, guess I'll go. Now then, what will I be running into? It's been a long time, Jiraiya Sensei. <gasps> You're... I knew it. There's no mistake. He's just as I last saw him. His eyes are as they were then. It was when I'd been living for a few months with those three in the Hidden Rain Village. In that era, the world had turned upside down. Bandits and thieves were common. And not only adults, but even children were becoming victims. I was careful, but Nagato and the others distracted them and they were attacked by Chunin from the Hidden Rock. But... When I came running to the scene, I found fallen rock ninja, a wounded Yahiko, Nagato, a host to the Rinnegan. The Rinnegan is the most sublime eye, and was possessed by the Sage of Six Paths, said to be the first of all ninja. It was thought to have been sent from heaven to a troubled world, but I never thought anyone who truly possessed the Rinnegan existed. His appearance has changed greatly, but that eye so after all this time, it's been you, Nagato. Does that mean Yahiko's here too? Yahiko? Ah, there was such a fellow, wasn't there? Used to be. He died a long time ago. Just like Conan, you aren't who you used to be either, Nagato. What's wrong? Just what happened? Nothing. Only the fight exists, an eternal chain of battles. What are you saying? There were too many deaths in this land. The pain forced me to grow up. Sensei, you are merely human. But as I was mired in endless battle, I am no longer trapped within humanity. I have moved toward the divine. <laughs> <laughs> now, who'd ever thought you'd learn to tell jokes? And calling yourself a god, no less. I'm not real impressed with your growth, Nagato. You are a mere human. You could never understand me. What are you trying to do? Why make this Akatsuki group and gather the tailed beasts? Since you are about to die, I don't need to keep it secret from you any longer. <sighs> we gather the tailed beast in order to develop new forbidden jutsu. Jutsu of such magnitude that each one could instantly destroy an entire nation. 
the weapons of forbidden jutsu. That's insane. Why make such a weapon? I'll give them to the warring countries. Of course, they will not fail to use that power. In an instant, many people will die. Then, people will shiver in terror. And all of humanity, all nations, the entire world, they would know pain. This fear would give rise to the end of warfare. Conflicts would cease. Do you see? The pain I give will make people grow. You think that's your mission? That's right. For I am a pacifist deity. Take any joke that far, and it's not funny. It looks like you've already come too far to turn back, doesn't it? Turning back was never an option. As a god, I will give pain to the world. That is all. Enough! You three were my students, and I believed you'd grow up right. I never doubted that you'd use your power to protect your loved ones. But, apparently, I was wrong. There's no point in talking further. You are a poison to the world. I will take responsibility and destroy you. That's the last thing I can do for you as your master. Conan, stand aside. I can handle this on my own. Understood. All right. Let's begin.
Jutsu. Gabakin, come! I have a plan. Buy me some time. Roger. it over not bad <gasps> summoning another summoning but I'm going to win this fight gamma kid go back yes sir sage mode he's gone this? Long time no see, Jemaya boy. Yeah, boss. Ma'am? Please lend me your strength. Okay, here I go. Knock them all down together. Major! Bath of
I'll end this. Jutsu. Nagato. I just want to protect them. No matter how much pain befalls me. Why did you turn out this way? <clears throat> It's done. That's the Rinnegan for you. Tough, huh? Sorry to summon you all the way out here. Make sure you rest up later. I'll go back to the Hidden Leaf Village, too, and... Not to let my guard down, didn't you, Sensei? What? Six of us. Huh? That face. You're Yahiko. Why are you? You see me in Yahiko's image. You really are his former teacher. Why? Why do you possess the Renegon? What are you talking about, Jiraiya boy? Another former student is also among them. Except he didn't used to have those pupils. What? It's been a long time. You sure you're not remembering wrong? No. Nagato definitely possessed the Rinnegan. Those memories are accurate. Then what? Are you saying there are real Rinnegan and fake ones? No. The visual prowess of the guys we just fought was extraordinary. I doubt the eyes of these new ones are fakes either. What's wrong? Fakes. Come to think of it, 
There's no proof that the first man I saw was Nagato either. And it really didn't feel like the Nagato I know. If I'm mistaken, if that Nagato is a fake as well, if that's true, then among these six right in front of me, Wrong. The real one isn't here. Jiraiya boy. What are you muttering about? It's a bit late for strategizing. No matter what strategy you implement, the end result won't change. Faced with us, no tactic will work. The only thing left for you is death. Only that. I'd expect of my teacher. Even under these conditions, your spirit hasn't faded. But the result won't change. You are finished here. Results can change as much as I want them to. As long as I've got the will to move forward without giving up. You do talk big. Let's see you change them then. These impossible, desperate circumstances.
my vision's gone blurry. You did well to come this far, I'll give you that. But... Curses! Fading. Am I going to die? Am I? I never go back on my word! <sighs> Until I become Hokage, there's no way I'm gonna die! Naruto. Being smart means what you say. I'll remain a fool my entire life. That's right. Naruto. You never gave up, no matter what. In that case... As your teacher. As your teacher, I... I must not give up. You're quite stubborn. Just give up. Give up? Never make me... It's over. So, the tale of Jiraiya the Gallant, finally, comes to a close. But, looking back, my life's tale was full of failure. What's more, I didn't manage to leave anything. <laughs> Definitely an obscure tale. No shape. No nothing. Just a... someone who will take over my will for me. Naruto Uzumaki. I'm glad I got to meet you. Walk with you. 
laugh with you, be with you. More than anything, that you'll take over my will and my place. I'm so glad. My story wasn't that bad after all. Just barely glorious, but glorious indeed. Now, this tale is just about over. It's about time I put down my pen. Ah, uh, what should I name the sequel? Yeah, let's see. The Tale of Naruto Uzumaki. Yes, that has a nice ring to it. Jiraiya of the legendary sun, actually dead. Still, how long has it been since I've had to fight that hard? We must extol our former teacher's strength. It's over. Right. What will you do now? Execute the orders from Madara. Then? Yes. As soon as we're ready, we'll go to the Hidden Leaf Village and capture the Nine Tails.